Welcome back. For those who are new here, hi, I'm teacher Milike. Nice to meet you. Welcome and welcome back to English Central. Today we will look at some stuff that hinder your pronunciation. Now, everybody wants to speak well, but they don't know what makes your speaking sound good. Let me tell you, we need fluency and clarity. Pronunciation mistakes kind of sabotage these, especially the clarity. Before we begin, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our exciting updates. Now, let's get started. Mistake number one, mispronouncing vowel sounds. Take a look at these examples. You may want to say you bout something, but you may accidentally say boat, and that may cause a misunderstanding. But be careful because your mistakes may not be as innocent as this one. Another mistake, peace and piss. Piss means the act of urinating or the urine itself. It would be very awkward if someone started to talk about urination out of the blue. Piss can also be used for the expression piss off which means go away but in a slang fashion which is pretty rude don't you think so it is important to mind your pronunciation of vowel sounds next up mistake number two misplacing the word stress this one can really throw off your listeners are you present or present when you say present it means a gift but when you say present it means the act of showing something. How about record and record? One of them is a noun. Which one is it? Make a guess. It is record. And they mean totally different things. As an example, I'm recording this video at the moment while our teachers are breaking their personal records with successful students. And guess what? They offer you your first lesson for free. Click on the link in the description box to have your free live lesson. You can also try group lessons. But for now, let's continue. Now, let's tackle mistake number three, mispronouncing consonant sounds. Watch closely. This one is similar to mistake number one, mispronouncing vowel sounds. As an example, thin can sometimes be pronounced as tin by substituting the th sound with the t sound. I know it might be hard for some to pronounce some sounds, but trust me, learning these sounds will help you a lot. That one small change in sound makes the meaning totally different. And last but not least, speaking too fast or too slow. Finding the right place is the key. I mentioned this before, speaking too fast won't make your speaking better. If anything, it might even sabotage it. It will make all the sounds in the word mix into each other, will give you anxiety, so it is bad. But also, it doesn't mean you should slow down too much, or you will lose the focus of your listener. Also, it may get harder for you to pronounce certain sounds. And there you have it. Four things to be mindful of when you're speaking regarding your pronunciation. Would you like to learn more? Keep watching our channel and you will find out. Or if you feel impatient, you can click on the link in the description box and visit our website to learn more about it. If you like this video, please consider giving us a like, subscribe and click on the notification bell. Don't forget to comment. I'm sure to see what you guys think. Until next time. Take care.